I'm Shauna Kronk, and I'm also a senior. And what? <laughs> and we're in duo, obviously. Yeah. And um, we'll be closing out the night. So. <laughs> Fireflies. Light is the ink we use. Night is our parchment. We're fireflies, fireflies flickering, flashing, fireflies glimmering, glowing. Insect calligraphers practicing penmanship, copying sentences. Six legged like scribblers of vanishing messages, fleeting graffiti, fine, fine artists in flight, adding dabs of light, bright brush strokes, signing the June nights as if they were paintings. We're flickering, fireflies, fireflies, fireflies. Fireflies, the artists of life. They paint a vision of peace and happiness. But what if bugs had a thought process? What if they didn't live lives based on instinct? What if their lives represented human life? The differences in teenagers, honeybees, the bad regrettable decisions one makes, house crickets, falling in love, getting married, the moth serenade, the crazy and hectic adventure life brings, whirligig beetles, having kids, sacrificing for them, and eventually letting them go, the digger wasp, reflecting on one's life, remembering everything they had gone through, Mayflies. Joyful noise reflects life, and the steps one takes throughout its course. Joyful noise, poems for two voices. By Paul Fleischman. Honeybees. Being, Being a bee, bee is a joy. It's a pain. I'm a queen. I'm a worker. All the life they explain. Upon rising, I'm fed by my royal attendants. Oh. I'm up at dawn, guarding the hive's <coughs> narrow entrance. I'm bathed. <laughs> then I take out the halves morning trash. And then I'm groomed. Then I put an hour to making wax without two minutes time to sit still and relax. The rest of my day is quite simply set forth. Then I might collect nectar from the field three miles north. I lay eggs. <laughs> I'm on larva detail. By the hundred. <laughs> Feeding the grubs in their cells, wishing I were still helpless and pale. I'm loved and I'm lauded, I'm all raped by none. Then I pat combs with pollen. Not my idea of fun. When I've done enough laying, and weary I strive, I retire to patch up any cracks in the hive for the rest of the day. Truly, a beast is the best of all lives. House crickets. We don't live in men. Living beneath this gas stove. Cricket! While mothers may worry. Cricket! About fall. We're scarcely aware of the seasons at all. Cricket! Spring the house cricket. Cricket! Means no more than the time when fresh greens once again grace the floor. Cricket! Summer's the season. Cricket! For pie crumbs. Peach, pear, boysenberry, apricot, plum. Cricket! Pumpkin seeds tell us. Falls arrive. Well, hot chocolate spills hint that it's winter outside. No, no matter the month, we stay well fed and warm. Unconcerned about cold fronts and wind chills and storms. For, for while others are ruled by the sun and the heavens, whose varying height brings the season's processions. We, we live, live in a world of fixed Fahrenheit. Thanks to our sun, our unchanging, reliable, steadfast and stable, bright blue pilot light. <laughs> the Moss Serenade. Port light, hear my plight. I drink your light like nectar. Dream of you by day. Gaze in your eyes all night. Port light, bright paradise. I am your seeking, circling, sighing, classic night. You are my soul's my desire, soul's desire. My, eyes, my eyes' delight. Porch light, my shining star, my compass needles north. Keep back, they say, I can't. Don't, Don't touch, they say, I must. Porch light, let's cast, let's cast, let's marry for a trice. Porch light, let's win, let's merge, let's live for love, for light. Whirligate beetles. We're whirly gig beetles, we're swimming in circles, 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 we
We're fond of the phrase that the whirling swims, meaning traveling by the most circular, circular roundabout, indirect, circular, twisty, twisty, best possible route. <laughs> the digger wasp. I will never see my children. They will never gaze on me. I'll have died when they're emerging next July. So it must be. Yet when they behold the home, I'm digging now for their protection. Safe and snug, far underground, they'll recognize my deep affection. When they learned I dragged it there, in spite of every interference, rocks and weeds, and thieving beetles, they'll discern my perseverance. Well cocooned they pass the winter, safe from snow and ice and chill, <coughs> they'll perceive and thank me for my formidable digging skill. By the time they're ready next July to climb up from their cells and break the burrow seal and fly away, my young will know me well. When they care for their own children, never to be looked upon, they'll feel my love and in replica, replica and know that they in turn were cherished by the mother digging ones, whose face and form they never saw. Mayflies. Your moment. Mayfly month. Your hour. Mayfly year. Your trifling day. Our life. We're mayflies just emerging, rising from the river, born this day in May. Birthday! And dying day. This particle of time, this single sip of living, all that we're allowed. We're, we're mayflies, mayflies by the millions, fever, frenzy, rushed, no redwood sentry to squander as we please. We're, we're mayflies swarming, swerving, rising high, and falling, then courting on the wing, and mating in midair. We're mayflies laying, laying eggs, our final frantic act. Sun's low, lights weak, in haste we launch them down the stream. We're mayflies lying, dying, floating by the millions on the very stream from which we sprung so very long ago. This morning, back when we were young. <laughs>